So, just got this in today. Looks like it's been on a FedEx truck for a while. Apparently FedEx lost it for a month. It has been missing in the supply chain. Well, we're going to open it up today. Thank God we got it. I'm going to show you what it is. So apparently every latch is open, except for this one with the cable tie on it. Well, we're going to see what's inside. I wonder who put this on here. Every latch is open. Hopefully it's still in there. All right, we're going to cut this. end off. Hard to do with one hand. Damn it. These things are really tough. I actually try to shoot cables like this with the 9s and 40s and whatnot and they do not break. There we go. All right, it's upside down. I'm gonna flip it over. All right, got it flipped over. Let's open it up. Oh my God. Oh, there's a zeroing target. Bag. All right, good. The gun's in here. Everything looks to be intact. Some mag pouches. There's the sling. There's the bipod. Man, this thing has had a rough ride in the truck. But everything looks all right. Let's check out this. Seekonk. Bet you it's on the gun. It better be on the gun. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Good, good. Cool. What do we have here, guys? This is an M110 deployment kit. The real deal. This is not a clone. Not a copy. This is an actual... M110. Where is it? There we go. Two hands for this. There we go. All right. Yep, bag still sealed. Open this up. All right, got the bag removed. There she is. Look at that. Beautiful. This is awesome. Got this from Jake at NS Defense. Been absolutely fantastic in procuring this for us. Knight's logo. 24 of 110. All right. Let's see if the suppressor's in the box or if that's coming in a separate shipment. Let's set this aside. So they're actually including the suppressor with the kit now. Oh, there it is. There we go. Look at that. All the magazines. One, two, three, four. There's some ten rounders. Little pouches. The six mags. Yep, looks like it. That's awesome. Cleaning rod. More mag pouches. Mandatory. Gun lock. Thank the federal government for that. What is this? Paper capsules. 
Ah. Huh. There's all the tools, all the cleaning supplies. Looks good. All right, let's get it set up on the bench. Take a look at it. All right, guys, we got it set up on the table here. Let's go ahead and take the uh, barrel noodle out. All right. Let's go ahead and check to see if it's unloaded. Kind of hard to do with one hand. All right, there we go. Got the camera set up. Go ahead and check, see if it's unloaded. All right, good to go. Let's pop it open. Here's the carrier, nice chrome plated finish, beautiful, dual ejectors, that is a lot of weight, it's very heavy, pretty awesome, I'll look inside real quick, we got the gold colored anodizing see the dirt from the test firing go ahead and throw it back together real fast all right got it back together go ahead and put the suppressor on kind of hard to do with one hand as well hold those tabs up Come on. Line that up. Push this down. Click. There it is. The zeroing target. We've got unsuppressed 0.39 inch, suppressed 0.47, unsuppressed 0.31, and suppressed 0.32. It's got a pretty consistent shift it's down a little bit three inches or so 100 yard target very pretty gun next video is gonna be this getting fired we're gonna see if we can run it head-to-head -head against a Scar Mark 20. This is Tony, the Atlanta Rifle Works, signing off.